Have you ever seen an out of bounds play that gets you a wide open layup, jump shot, and three pointer in one single set? This play is called 21 and it starts in a square formation where you are actually going to run the initial action on the far side or opposite side of the ball. The only thing you need to do is really think opposite, so try and have your big player at the top and your small player at the bottom. The small guard is going to come and set a screen up at the top of the elbow and then we get a nice UCLA type of action with the big coming in for the wide open layup or dunk. Two really important details that you might not have noticed, check out how the big is actually looking like he is the one that is going to be setting the screen and also check the guard's angle which allows for the big to get to the outside away from the help defender down low. There's a reason for using the smallest player on the court to set that screen and that is because the chess move to play this defensively is to switch it which is exactly what the Raptors tried to do to stop this play however you can see that Lowry is just too small to take on the big. So that that first action is easy to read. If they don't switch it, you get an easy layup. If they do switch it, you get a mismatch on the interior of the defense. The defense isn't going to let you score layups the entire game, so they are going to adjust. And once they adjust, you just go into the next progression of the play, and that is going to get you a wide open jump shot. Now, this is what I like to call set and get because you're going to set that first initial screen and then get a screen from the top side of the square. You probably noticed that the defense completely smothered that first play with some help, so the bottom of the square where actually kicks out to receive the pass and then he is going to pass to the person getting that second screen. Now what happens if every option up to this point is covered? Well we got you. Oh actually that is pretty wide open right there but we're gonna pretend that he's covered. Once again you have the bottom right square popping out which is Al Horford and he swings the ball to the wide oh he's covered too so we've got to go to our next option. Horford moves the ball up top like he's supposed to and then immediately goes and sets a pin down screen for the person who passed the inbound. I'm going to show you a bonus variation which I like even more than the three point shot but take a look here. We once again have every single action covered in this scenario so Kyle Korver plays it extra cool and as a result Result gets even more open for this three-point shot. I found a bonus wrinkle just in case that three-point play is not there and that is going into this beautiful pick and roll action and if you like wide open plays you should definitely check this one out right here.